have Rhonda Allen. I work at Westgate Hills Re Rehabilitation Center in Baltimore City. My main concern with this pandemic and this COVID is that we didn't have enough PPE. We didn't get paid cash to pay. We were paid one month of cash to pay when we dealt with the pandemic when it first hit and training for our nurses, our DNAs, and also housekeeping. I work in the housekeeping department and we we wasn't ready for COVID. This COVID pandemic took a toll on everybody's mental status. As you come to work well, you can leave sick. And you don't know if you're taking it back to your, your family and your loved ones. So my main concern is pay to pay, training for all staff from administration down to dietary, to, to nursing, and to housekeeping. And PPE is a must. Our building was a building that was affected, and we had over 66 cases with um, residents and over 30 cases with employees. So with that being said, we should have been well compensated for our time and our dedication to come to work every day during this pandemic. We need mental health days. That's something that all nursing homes should be given mental health days especially during this pandemic because you don't know if you're coming or going you're dealing with the fact that you are walking into a deadly a possibly deadly environment not knowing if you're going to take it home that play that takes a big toll on your mental health i hope everything is taken into account and that my concerns don't fall on deaf ears as a 11.99 union member i would like to see more people more hazard pay, more training on how to deal with this COVID in long-term care facilities.